Here's the video of the first night when I actually saw them in my yard, when I heard them drive back to their house next door. And when I got the video out, this is me um, walking down from the chicken coop down to the spot where I saw them. I'm standing by the motion sensor light and I'm looking around and I'm seeing if there's anyone there, like still like lingering. And I don't see anyone <laughs> until now. And you'll, you'll see in just a second. I have no idea what that sound was. I'm, I'm guessing maybe the railroad, it could be them. I have no idea. What's really weird, this was the day before I realized there were drones involved. Well, looky, looky, Mr. Drone is right there. This is before I realized that there were drones watching. I think I'm standing and kind of looking around and seeing if I'm finding anyone. But you're going to see Mr. Drody Drone make another cameo. It's nice of him to make a little cameo. It's too bad I didn't realize that there were drones at that time. Do you see him? You know, I watch for them now. Oh, there he is. Oh, there he is again. Yep. Ooh, there. Yep. Watching. I'm going to keep talking as we walk. We'll multitask and save time. I'm going to mark the trails. What I was following was the dew tracks. That's all I was following. So I was following through my phone. I didn't even know what part of the yard we were in. And when I was doing this video, I got lost in all the trails. I was seeing, so there's marks all over the place. Because I also, during the video, I didn't, I couldn't tell which track I was following, so I was marking to make sure I wasn't like losing the spot. But seeing like how many tracks there are. So if you want to see it more thoroughly, I would suggest to slow the camera down. But for other people, I sped it up for you a little bit so this wasn't so, so long. Okay, I'll keep talking. And I'll pause on certain little spots to pay attention to, I think. Yeah, as as I'm looking for the trespassers. So there's Molly's nose. You know, I watch for them now and I know to look, but there's something really weird how this feels because this was before I knew that they watched me. It feels extra weird and creepy and disturbing watching and editing this video, knowing that they were watching me and I was unaware. What's also strange is realizing how used to it I've become and how it's become more um, routine and how how much worse it's gotten how during this video I noticed I all I saw was one drone and just how many more and how obsessed and grotesque these guys are oh pause look at this part look how look how dug up this yard is and you could see that there's a line in the middle as if this is a vehicle um, driving back and forth and back and forth as if this is a main little lane. That doesn't look like nothing as far as damage. Do you guys think? Just wanted to point that part out. See, and that part's still going. So they use this little section a good bit. You could see what parts they use often um, because it's, it's red and you could tell I had to discolor it so I can see it better on camera. But the, the ground you could see the dirt easier where they the places where they frequently use the the ground there's no it's dirt you can see it and see the these little dark spots that's that's more so what i'm following because there was dew on the grass and so you could see where they were driving that night because that real light spot that kind of like sparkly sheen that's all dew that was on the tops of the grass so this dark green it's all their tracks that it just happened see look at all that dirt that's from their four wheels oh it's not that bad said sergeant marshall And it's one thing if I dig something up, I don't want someone else digging up parts of my yard because they don't know what I'm doing to my yard. Look at that. Look at all of that. So what's, what's so disturbing is how obsessed these guys are. And 
how every night it's, and it's not like these, also these guys have property. They, they could go into their own property, but they don't. And every time I try to do something to protect myself and to protect my property, there's something more damaging that they do to kind of teach me a lesson. Um, there's something more damaging that they do. And see, there's obvious tracks. But in the police report, in police report number one, it shows they claim there's no evidence of trespassers. I changed the coloring on this one a little bit. I forget what I, oh, I know, it, the, we're getting to like a little swirly part where they were, um, the part where specifically Sergeant Marshall said, it's not that bad, because he was talking about like his lawn, and I don't have a lawn that has only like a couple inches of yard. It's like, this is, this is my fucking yard, but you could see, you could see where he's turning. You can actually see that. Those marks. And I, oh, I see it now. At first I was wondering, I'm like, why do I have that marked? Some of these marks did get out of alignment. That's also what made this frustrating, but I see it. And I, sometimes I made these flashes quicker. So you could also have a chance to see the actual path. But you could see the lines where it's, it's track marks. And my tractor, well, I don't go, I don't bush hog and I don't go into the property that often because of these guys. Oh, here we go. Look at this spot. I, I tried to line every single, that, that's why I changed the coloring. That's the spot where Sergeant Marshall goes, that's not that bad. So I, I was trying to change the color so I could try to find like the marks, the little swirl marks, because it is hard to, it's hard to see now, like in through the camera. But yeah, that was the spot where he just mocked me, like kind of like, that's nothing. Yeah. Looking back at it, it looks like they kind of fucked up my yard right there. I don't see anything growing right there. Looks like they kind of tore some shit up right there. You could see where they're creating their own trails. They're going in through little woodsy brushy areas you can see that line in the middle you could see another one I slowed it down here I am just marking like crazy but again if you guys follow where there's kind of that light sheen like almost like a bluey green because that's the little dew mist there you could see where they're making their own trails that dark green and I didn't realize this at the time, but here are marks that go straight to my deer cam. Look at that. There's my deer cam. So that, before I called the police, I grabbed my deer cam to try to um, see the images. And this little area where there's all these little marks, that is the main area where um, he goes in and out um, right at my property line. It's next to a giant tree. And I call it the scrap graveyard because that's where the all like the old farmers and stuff put the old equipment and everything. You can see, yep, you could see you could see the new marks in this specific area. You're gonna see Molly run across. Yeah, the, there's brand new marks right here because you could see the dew. Even watching over this right now, I I could see more and more all the little tracks. So this was night one. Where I kept saying over and over and over again is I have video. I took video of the trails. I specifically took video to show the officers so they could see evidence and so they could walk the trails, you know, so they could protect me. So none of this would happen that's going on right now. But they didn't. And they, they I mean, I, I practically had to beg them and then Sergeant Marshall mocked me the whole time.